have to start at the basics and you have to one, get people interested in the sport, but two, provide a way for them to learn the sport. Provide the way to, to take the stepping stones that are necessary to get into a competitive environment. Rallying, to me, is pure excitement, adrenaline, and enjoyment. My name is Steve Rimmer. For my sins, I'm the owner and proprietor of Dirtfish Rally School, uh, which has been located here in Snoqualmie since June 2010. When I looked at North America, there was nothing here which would allow me to enjoy, participate, or learn anything in terms of rally or rally cross. So rally and a rally school, I think, went together to try and bring rallying to more people. Rally to me is just so pure. It's being an all-rounder. You have to be very good on pavement. You have to be very good on a street circuit. You have to be very good on a track. And then that's just a sealed surface. If you go into gravel, uh, you have to be very good on a loose surface. You have to be good on snow. A good rally driver is good on any surface at any time in any weather. It's a different type of rally school than a lot of others, where what we offer them is you know, very performance-based. The, the cars are really high-end. Uh, we have a pretty big facility so that you can actually make use of them. Having dirt fish in the Northwest is a game changer. Before that, uh, there was nothing on this side of the States, and there was only a couple places you can go in all of North America if you wanted to do something like this. I went up there uh, before I got in this car last year at X Games and just took a one day class just to try to get my bearings around driving an all wheel drive car and it helped me so much getting into one of these cars. So, I mean, you go up there and they have cars that are similar to what we're racing and you get to go and drive them all day. This dirt fish is amazing. They're, they're, so, they're so dialed when it comes to teachers and and the stages and how to get certain people to listen. They're really good at breaking it down and, and taking a weekend racer and turning him into a, a champion. We start out in pretty basic, simple areas that allow you to get comfortable with the car in that environment. And we start on the handling course with a skid pad, depending on uh, which drive train you're in. That allows you to uh, figure out the, the car, understand the techniques, and, and really feel it. So much of a rally is feeling because you're sliding so much. And then once we understand that, we move on to the slalom. That's where we take the techniques of learning how to slide the car and actually give you some specific targets. And the slalom is, is very unforgiving and that if you miss one cone, then you're gonna spend the next three or four trying to catch it back up. And then we wrap it up on the boneyard, which is basically a short gravel course that allows you to uh, open the car up a little bit more, see what it's like on uh, a real road, and get a chance to have some longer slides, longer corners, and bring that precision, then match that into carrying a bit more speed here and there. Beyond that, then we start to introduce some uh, mixed surfaces, so on and off pavement. And that can be quite challenging because it changes every single lap. It can be very slippery, it can be very grippy depending on the day. So it allows you to change your driving habits, your driving techniques, whatever it may be to, to get the most out of the car at that particular time. Progression continues all the way from our short programs up to our longer programs, which include higher speeds, more risky courses and much more advanced techniques. The point is that you get comfortable with the car beforehand at lower speed in a more open environment so you really can test your limits and what the car is capable of doing before we throw you out into the woods and crank up the speed quite a bit. It's really fun to take someone who has zero experience and get them up to a level where they can actually have some fun and, and drive a rally car properly. Uh, and then the other fun part of my job is to get somebody who's a little bit better and is able to 
uh, we're able to tweak them a little bit more and, and get them to be faster, more precise, more accurate, and that's really cool. I think the, the really cool part about Dirtfish is that um, anybody can go, and they've got you know, kind of school for all levels, and everyone's like, oh, do you teach? I'm like, no, I still go there and get instruction. So to have a place where you can go, uh, where you've got top-notch mechanics, top-notch uh, you know, instruction, and top-notch facility, that is something that Dirtfish is gonna really add to the whole rally community. The best way to start for anyone that wants to get you know, involved in rally or rally cross is to go to those types of schools and learn. Because you can waste all sorts of time and money uh, trying to race, but if you don't have the right base skills, you're not going to be successful. When you take the elements of rally and then think about rally cross, and you think about the demographics out there, rally cross became a, a big part of the thinking behind Dirtfish running one uh, car in the GRC lights for Tanner Witten, who is also an instructor here at Dirtfish. That car and that team is the next stepping stone for Dirtfish in providing to people who come here the opportunity to actually go out and compete. It's a completely different can of worms. It's, uh, it's not production based at all, which our other cars are. It's designed specifically for Rallycross, and so it's a very, very unique experience. It takes definitely some understanding of how to drive a series car as well, so that's why it's our, our crown jewel in our progression for sure. It's, it takes some understanding of, of each one of the aspects of the cars that we have uh, along the path there. about rallying some form of motorsport here. So being able to develop cars to offer the customers and be able to work with customers, and then now having a lights car, that is super exciting. It just brings it up to the next level. From its conception in 2010 to what it is today, we've started out being something which was very motorsport focused, something which now has grown into team building, manufacturer interaction, and competition. A team of people who are the heart and soul of this business, um, supported by a facility which is unique in so many different ways and offers the capability to do so many different things. In terms of educating North America, really, on the sport of rally in general, I feel we're doing our, our best to do that. I'm a huge rally fan from, from a little kid. I feel like I'm able to give back to the sport a little bit by getting more people involved with it and then give them an environment in which to, to play with the sport because it's the coolest motorsport in the world.